All right, uh, back on the uh, clay today, and we'll see what we do and how far we get. <laughs> Hopefully we get to some point. All right, be right back. Time to play with some clay. As you can see, I pinned my anatomy drawing to his body. So I've got a close-up view of uh, this front leg from this, this side. And uh, now it's time to get to work on that leg. I need a smaller wire tool for that. I got one camera right now that's got a good view but its view isn't the best either but uh, I'm going to do the best I can with what I got and I'm sorry if it uh, is blocked occasionally by my hand but there's nothing I can really do about that this is a metal tool that's uh, rounded all the way around kind of a flattish type round it's not a complete round but uh, it works perfect for filling in space like between these muscles here I'm going to try to do as much as I can here. Making the uh, hoof of a steer or a cow or a longhorn it's basically the same as making one for the horse just a little different well quite a bit different I mean there's a split in the uh, the hoof These are the dew claws above the uh, above and behind the uh, hoof. There are two of them. Buffalo have them too. I think most split hoofed animals do have them. This may not seem to be, but it is very stressful because I'm not used to sculpting this particular kind of animal, so I'm going at it new, even though I did it 20, 30 years ago. It's, uh, it's new now. 
All right, my attention is shifted to this side of the Longhorn. I've turned off the heater. I hopefully have enough heat to keep me warm till I'm done today. Because I find I don't like that noise <laughs> blaring away. I really have lousy anatomy drawings. getting a headache from all of this today. <clears throat> I'm, I'm happy the way this is turning out. And, uh, but I think I'm going to take a break. Come back to this tomorrow. Whew. At least I got this side to where I'm comfortable with it. And 
and uh, I hit the tail a couple of times and broke the hairy end off a little bit, but I, I put it back on. I knew I would do that. All right, everybody, have a great night, and I'll see you next time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.